Wow, good run today. So this week I completed for the whole week a marathon, 26.26 miles. So really good. It's funny how um, you compare yourself to other people, which you really shouldn't do. You know, I thought this 26 mile thing was gonna be a big accomplishment. And then I met a guy that last weekend ran 100 miles and not too much younger than me, so 100 miles, four times what I'm getting ready to do. But at any rate, what you need to learn to do is the best you can do to improve yourself, to get better than your previous self, to go all in, to do everything it takes. I love to say, leave no doubt, so lay it all on the line, push yourself a little harder, take that extra step, go for whatever it is you want. Don't compare yourself to others, compare yourself to who you were yesterday. Awesome trail run today. I read a post, a runner post that said, you know, you're not gonna get better unless you really push yourself, push yourself to be uncomfortable, push yourself further than you can. I really tried to push myself today, I did a great job. Woo, it's a hot one, tired. I believe, I'm not sure, I'll have to check later, but I believe it might have been the fastest trail run I ever did. Four and a half miles in the heat. It was fun, but the goal, obviously, the goal is to stretch so that I can get faster on my miles, stronger ankles, stronger calves, stronger hips when I run the trails. So we're gonna keep running trails on Sundays. We're gonna try to explore some new ones soon stretch the distance, stretch the speed. You know, the main thing I want you to know is you can push yourself. And if you need somebody to push you, because I do, I need somebody to push me sometimes too. You can push me, I can push you. Together we can stretch on whatever goals we want. So keep on keeping on. Just a few days ago I read a running tip that you have to push yourself. Push yourself hard so you feel like you're gonna throw up. Push yourself real hard. I did that today on my four mile run. My first run, my first mile was eight minutes, 30 seconds. Second one, seven minutes, 57 seconds. Fastest mile I've run all year. Third was eight, 14. And the fourth mile was eight, 12. It was also a record 5K for me this year, 25 minutes and 28 seconds beating my other run that was I believe 25 46 so you got to push yourself and when you push yourself and stretch yourself you grow you've got to grow and sometimes it's hard to push yourself it's hard to push yourself but you I'm here to help you I'm here to try to push you to encourage you to stretch you to grow you it can be done baby it can be done you just got to push a little bit harder a little bit faster a little bit longer no matter what it is you're doing whether it's a relationship whether it's in sales building a business whether it's in your health your eating habits your exercise habits just learn to push yourself a little bit more or get some help from somebody else i'll be glad to help you i'll be glad to encourage you just contact me wow 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 what a great run today today the goal was distance and form to do a good long distance which six has been my recent long lately and to change my form up and i change my form to where my feet are more directly under me my arms go side to side and my legs kick back to my butt you know just not even pushing hard my feet go faster and uh, from what I understand, it helps you avoid shin splints and not even trying to beat my record of last week, six miles, which I did in 52.28. Today I did it in 52.21. 52.21 without pushing it, just by correcting my form, using a better form. It was a great run today. You know, it's good to study and learn new things and try new things and experiment. Uh, I did have my hydro pack on today, getting ready to lengthen the long run. Tonight I'm gonna run with the Derby City Run Club, maybe three miles, but I'm gonna keep on working on my form, my distance, my positive attitude, my mental 
But what I really want to do is I want to set an example for you so that you know that you can do it, so that you know that it's possible, that you know that with changes come growth and with growth comes uh, success and with success comes love. And when you feel good about yourself, you can definitely help others. So just want to say, keep on doing whatever it is you want to do. Keep growing, stretching yourself, learning new things and be your best. Be your personal best. Be better than who you were yesterday. Steve Briner, founder and president of Leave No Doubt, wanting to tell you that you're a winner. You can do it, and winners win.